Hi, Ralph. Um, at half time, Gary Neville described your team as a bunch of whinge bags, meaning I think they complained rather than played football in the first half. What would you say to that? What, what did he say? I, I, I haven't ever heard the word. Whinge. Tell them a, a bunch of whinge bags, which, and I think he meant they just spent too much time complaining rather than getting on with the match. I think I don't think today it was a problem of body language. It was more of a question of uh, physicality, of uh, yeah, meeting the demands with regard to speed, tempo, physicality, uh, and yeah, the side effect is the body language afterwards. That that's that's, <laughs> but the, I don't think that that was the major problem today for us. The major problem was yeah, the way that we played in those moments when it was about physicality. Well, yeah. we didn't play. We we didn't play good today. So the first half was uh, um, after having been down one 0 after seven minutes. Uh, we just had too many unforced errors, too many giveaways when we were in possession of the ball, um, including the goal, by the way. And uh, yeah, that 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 didn't make life any easier for us uh, in this game. Of course, it was a massive push for for Newcastle, and um, in the first half we didn't play we didn't play good at all. I was not happy with the performance in the first half. Second half, uh, we had to take the risk of changing formation and making two substitutions with Eddie um, and with Jaden. Um, yeah, it was better in the second half, but still not on the kind of level that we would have to play in order to to control games. Um, so for me, there were two problems. One was uh, yeah, the, the unforced errors, the technical errors, the wrong decisions in possession of the ball. This caused a lot of transitional moments for Newcastle, and we knew that they were, especially in, the, in that area, they were, they were a very good team with their fast offensive players. And the other one was that we didn't play as aggressive as we should have played against the ball with regard to counter-pressing. But that, again, is a question of physicality. Um, how quickly do we react on losing the balls? And um, and how how aggressive are we with regard to counter-pressing? In both areas, we were not on the kind of level, especially, as I said, in the first half, um, as we should have been. Yeah, I don't think it's a question. Today, it was not a problem of, of uh, formation. It was a, a problem of energy and uh, um, yeah, intensity, also of speed uh, in the way how we how we play in those direct one-on-one -on -one duels. Um, and uh, this is something we have to get better at. And um, as I said, second half, we, we changed from a 4-2-2-2 into a 4-1-3-2. Uh, had two wingers. Uh, we the intention was to play more over the wing. That was also the way that we prepared our our equalizer. Um, and we had another two good opportunities uh, um, when we played the ball behind their back four. Um, Eddie sh could have scored another another one, but on the other hand, we again also in the second half we were too open. We were not um, good in the counter pressing moments. Again, too many giveaways in midfield. And we still allowed them two or three good uh, counter-attack uh, situations uh, when Eddie was, uh, when when uh, David Gea was outstanding again.